guys, this is going to be my very first workout clothing haul. I do a lot of clothing hauls all the time on random other fashionable things, but I've never actually done a haul video on workout clothes. But the more and more I'm going to the gym, obviously I'm having a lot of fun shopping and I find that when I'm wearing stuff that excites me, it gets me more motivated and excited to actually go to the gym. So not to say that I'm always there matchy-matchy. I would prefer to match and I have enough of enough stuff that I can, but um, anyway, I've had a lot of stuff kind of accumulating. A lot of the stuff I've had for months, I don't even know if you could still get it, but I just kind of thought I would throw everything together in this haul. Some of the stuff I got recently, I decided to check out the new Carrie Underwood Calia line at Dick's recently and I ended up picking up some other stuff there and I have some stuff from Lululemon and Target of course so I just wanted to share everything with you. Let's start, let's start Target, Target, Target. For the most part, I tend to stick to basic black and gray for my workout stuff just like in my normal wardrobe but when I was in Target recently, they had this beautiful hot coral and like highlighter yellow stuff that came out and it just got me really excited for spring. I'm still bundling up to go to the gym. I'm still wearing some long sleeve stuff because it's still freaking cold here, but um, I figured I would get this stuff to wear when it actually decides to be nice outside. So this is just a regular tank and these are from the Champion line for Target. It's like a hot coral ombre light peach color. I got it in that coral color. I got it in black. These were $14.99. Got them in a small. They have the Duo Dry, which keeps you dry and not sweaty. And it's very stretchy, which is really nice. They're very form-fitting. They're really great. I also got this one from the Champion line. It's a little bit of a different style, but it's the same kind of... Um, it's a different texture, I should say, but the same style shirt. So love these to just throw over a sports bra and your leggings, yoga pants, whatever. This is a pullover. Like I said, still wearing these because it's so damn cold out. These were only $22.99, which I found between Lululemon, even Victoria's Secret. Uh, the Carrie Underwood line, I think, is priced similar to, say, Gap's workout stuff. Target I have found to be the most reasonably priced, the most inexpensive, and the quality is not compromised, so I really am happy about that because workout clothes can be expensive. So this is the highlighter yellow one, it's just a zip up, and then I got the full track jacket in the coral. They had that one, they had like a zip up in the coral color, but I went for the actual jacket. I just love this color. I actually think I put, I had this on in a recent video. I think my Erin Condren video, I just filmed the intro like right after I had gotten back from the gym and I still had this on so if you want to see what it looks like. It's just really a bright, really bright pretty color and you stand out like a sore thumb but it's fine. I got this sports bra. Target has a lot of really nice sports bras. A lot of the sports bras that I have have come from Target. This one again, I just really like the color. It's very lightweight. It's pretty thin but um, it's not really supportive. If you need that, probably wouldn't work for you but it's just this hot coral and purple racer back. So that's that. I found this tank on an end display and this is by Mossimo, like by the clothing. This wasn't in the workout section but I just really liked it. It's a racer back tank, racer back tank, heathered gray and black trim and the sizing is weird. It's extra small, small slash petite I think and this fits me really well and it's really long which I kind of like. I like having longer things. And then this track jacket, which I had seen one very similar in color to this one in Lululemon, this like really fine heather gray, fine, fun heathered gray and black. I had seen one very similar in Lululemon, but they didn't have my size. So when I saw it at Target, I picked it up. They had this in a lot of colors. But again, I just, uh, mostly all the leggings that I have are black or gray, so I like having a track jacket like this because it kind of just goes with everything. It has a hood, drawstring, and this one was 40 I think something? $39.99. And I got it in a small. So that's everything I got from Target. Next I'll share with you the stuff that I got from Lululemon. So this shirt I've had for a while. It's not on the website anymore, but I have still seen it in stores. It's a beautiful, really lightweight, very comfortable, lightweight top. The back is open. 
It looks really cool with any kind of, you know, strappy sports bra. I actually bought this as a top. I wouldn't work out in this. I think I would be too hot. I tend to go in a sweatshirt or a track jacket and work out and as I get warmer, take it off. I know I would just get really claustrophobic working out in a <laughs> long sleeve top. So I got this just as a just as a top because I have some really pretty strappy bralettes and lacy bralettes and they just look really nice with, with this shirt. But it's sheer and white and really pretty. I just love white shirt. I also found this on sale. It was only 64. I think it was originally 128. It is a zip up pullover and just in black and it has the little thumb holes on the sleeves. The back has different texture detail and and just basic. I also got this sports bra and I normally would never buy sports bras at Lululemon because they're just you can find them at Target so much cheaper but it's gray and white, but I just love the back. It's mint green and the inside's mint green, really strappy. So I actually have worn this with that white top and it just looks really pretty with the mint popping, peeking out the back. So I did get this, but like I said, I would never buy like a, like a typical sports bra at Lululemon because you could just find them cheaper elsewhere. And I got a new pair of black leggings because the ones I have are starting to look a little ratty. And these go to about mid-calf and they have a hint of heathered gray at the back of them, which I like, and then some sheer netting as well. So I like this, it goes really well with the track jacket I showed you in the top from Target, that heathered gray. They're just so comfortable. They're probably my favorite workout leggings. They're just so darn expensive. But the, qual the uh, texture, the material of them is so much nicer than the ones from, from the Gap. The Gap crop leggings are let me just grab a pair so I can show you. So these are some that I have from The Gap. And as you can see, like, I just wash these. I just put them away from laundry. They're just very linty. They attract every little piece of lint, Jake's hair. They just, it's annoying, like strings. They just are a magnet for that. It's just the material of the pants. So I actually wear these more so like around the house or out running errands than to actually work out. And I do wear them sometimes for working out, but I prefer the kind of like slick, smooth material of the Lululemon leggings and the other ones I'm going to show you in the haul. The more nylon material up for leggings for working out just because too like when you sweat the ones from the Gap tend to feel a lot heavier on but that's uh that's that. So next the Calia line. I am a big big fan of Carrie Underwood so when I heard she was coming out with a workout line I was so excited to just support her. I knew it was going to be beautiful. Uh, you just kind of have a feeling because her fashion choices just never are wrong. I found this gorgeous gray heathered um, sports bra with, again, that cross back detail and with the coral and peach ombre. And these were $40. So again, like a little more expensive than I'd like to pay for a sports bra. But there is a lot of padding, really great support, really thick. And I just like, I love the color of it. So I got that. These leggings, which these are that same kind of nylon material as the Lululemon leggings, and they're kind of ruched on the bottom. They kind of go right below your knee. And these were $65, which is right around the price of the Gap Body or the Gap Athletic leggings. And I just really like the pattern. They're, you know, they're flowery pattern, but they're black. And I have a lot of black workout stuff, so I thought that they would work really well. And I actually love the print so much that I got it in this top as well. Not that I would wear them together, but with just plain black or gray leggings. It has a built-in bra, so you have a lot of support. I went for the extra small because the small was a little bit big, and I would probably wear this without a sports bra, so I wanted it to fit a little bit tighter, so I did get the extra small, and this was $50. And again, it's that same material as the nylons. Just really, really pretty. So... That's that Carrie Underwood's line also. She has a lot of like just nice loungewear and comfortable shirts and tops and stuff that you could wear to yoga, really good stuff. But again, like nice stuff, but probably more expensive than your average like basics to just lounge around in. And then while I was at Dick's, I scoured the sale racks and I found this really pretty mint jacket. I think this was actually like in the golf section, but it's mint green. It's a zip up and really comfortable and it was $18. So you can't beat that. I have a huge hair and 
I got these leggings, which are very similar, again, in texture to the other ones I just showed you. They're gray. The back has this, the back and the bottom has the mint green lining. And these are by Under Armour. And these were fairly inexpensive. I think they were $34 or somewhere around there. I also obviously love the color mint, showed you the bra that I had, the track jacket, and I actually have sneakers that are gray and like Tiffany blue slash mint, so I thought they would go really nice, I don't know. You guys know me, I love fashion, so it's not like I'm not gonna enjoy fashionable <laughs> workout clothes too. And the last stuff that I have to show you is from Victoria's Secret, and these I got, they're kind of like open back tank tops, so just, I like these for doing yoga or like the Zumba class that I take sometimes. It's just a easy breezy top. I wouldn't wear something like this to go running because it's just really soft and it would really annoy me when I run. I like to just wear stuff that's more form fitting that's not going to annoy me. And then I also got this top which is kind of a drapey neck and the back is kind of open. So just in a really basic blue and then I found this actually whenever you order from Victoria's Secret they always send you like the clearance catalog and I never do well I really don't even look through it all that much but for some reason I felt prompted to look through the clearance section and I found this bright pink new favorite piece of workout gear in there this track jacket and it was on clearance for $44.99 and I had a secret reward but I thought, I was like shocked to see this on clearance because I would think everybody would want a hot pink track jacket. It has the thumb hole and ruching on the sleeves and on the sides. And the sides are a little bit more sheer in color and material than the back and the front. And it's just a zip up and has zip pockets, which I love because I normally have to have my keys with me and my cell phone because I like to listen to music. And the last thing I'm going to show you are a new pair of sneakers that I got and I ordered these I think from Shopbop and they're just basic New Balances. They are black and they have hot pink laces and I got these because all my leggings are black and believe it or not the other sneakers that I have are really bright and colorful and don't always work with my neutral stuff so I wanted to get more black slash neutral shoes and who doesn't love pink shoelaces? And I wear a size 9 because I have huge feet. If you guys like these kind of videos, let me know. I know not everybody works out or enjoys the gym. I, for the longest time, hated it, despised it, didn't want anything to do with it. So if you are someone like that, you probably don't want to see videos like this. But I'm just curious if you guys like this or not. Honestly, a lot of the stuff that I buy is, for me, it doubles as loungewear. It's stuff that I can just wear around the house or to run errands or just be comfortable in. So just some some good, fun, colorful basics. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye. And the highlighter looks like a shimmery glitter ball in the palette, but when it goes on your cheeks, it just is the perfect amount of light and glimmer.